Well guys, what is up? It is obviously me, FlyGuyN05 here, coming at you with a, probably a re-upload, I guess, of a model that I, like, was my, this was my first 1400 model, I guess, of the Air Canada Boeing 777-200LR. And, uh, yeah, so, I'm gonna do a re-upload of this because I was, like, actually, like, yesterday I was looking through my YouTube channel and I looked at this video and A, my voice sounds high pitch, and yeah, <laughs> I kind of sound like a scrawny trap. So I'm going to redo this one. Plus it only has 14 views, because I, I only labeled it Air Canada 777-200LR. I didn't put like unboxing or any friggin' information or like that. So, yeah. Um, I guess let's just start off the basic features of the aircraft. Let's start off with the windows here, I guess. Um, by the way, I'm recording with the new iPhone 5S, except that I can't open it with my finger anymore because I kind of sliced all the skin off, but whatever. Um, like, uh, this is even, I haven't even actually really seen if this is, oh crap, I can zoom in. Nice. So, I don't know if you can see that or not. It's actually really blurry. You can, you probably can't. Actually, what does this white thing do? Does this make it focus? No, I just took a picture. Whatever. I'm still trying to figure out how to use this thing. You can't see. This doesn't focus, but... Uh, right below the uh, windows... Oh, you can, I, you can see now. Uh, right there you see the nose cone and the wiper blades of the aircraft. And obviously the windows, um, and then the front landing gear, obviously below the nose right there. Let's just go to this side of the aircraft right there, that little gray speck. Can I, can I get it to focus? It's, you can kind of see it, it's a Star Alliance logo obviously, that's what Airlines Air Canada is in. And the exit door with its little details on it. Obviously Air Canada here, the big beautiful red with the maple leaf. And, uh, yeah. Uh, powder blue aircraft. Eight emergency exits, four on each side. The beautiful maple leaf. Uh, the registration, maybe, uh, C-F-I-U-J. Charlie Foxtrot India Uniform Juliet, I believe. I believe so. Actually, let's... Turn this back around here and see if I. Oh yeah, thank you. So I guess my videos are gonna be a lot more awesome now because I can actually zoom in. But yeah, just oops, my zoom in of my finger. Hey, uh, but yeah, just uh, exits and stuff like that. I guess on the aircraft as well, um, and obviously the wing tips with the lights and the strobe lights and yeah uh underbelly of the plane obviously just the same just the gemini jets uh the cargo hold i really can't see them on here oh yeah there's one and the other one hello right right there i think so anyways yeah I don't know, for some reason I always screw up my fingers always in the lens for the friggin' screensaver on YouTube or whatever. Anyways, yeah. So that's the AirCan 777-200LR, um, sorry, AirCan 777-200LR review. Um, so, so I haven't been active lately, it's just I haven't, like, bought any models, and plus I've actually been, like, refing to get, like, money and crap. Uh, but, went to see if Threshold Aviation was having their big Black Friday sale. They didn't really have a sale. They were just advertising their website, which pissed me off. A and B, um, my Christmas present was going to be an Air Canada Rouge Boeing 767-300 until I found out that they are sold out, and now I'm mad at my parents forever. So, uh, that kind of ticked me off. Like, majorly ticked me off because I'm like, I, like every week I reminded my parents, I'm like, hey, can you, can you get me this? They're like, what do you want? Rouge 767 300, thanks. So, uh, never, I'm probably never gonna get that. But, uh, um, in the December releases, I'm hoping for an Air Canada. Uh, probably. Um, and actually in February, you guys, I might be going on vacation back down to Florida. 
So I've been actually to Florida multiple times, but I've never been there and recorded. So obviously that'd be a good place for me to record probably the A321 and stuff, but yeah. Um, what else? Great Cup weekend, which was like two, three weekends ago. Oh yeah, our airport was full. We had like a tarmac of A320s basically. Um, and other than that, that's really it. Um, I'd just like to thank you guys for watching again. Sorry I haven't been active. I'm gonna try and get like more models, I guess. More models to try and post because this is just ridiculous. I don't have like any models. And before I go, actually, I'd like to show you guys something. I actually made a model airplane myself here. So let's put you off to the side. Let's just look at the box here for a second. Boom. Look at that. I made myself a model airplane wood shop. Look at that. So, uh, yeah, like, look how nice that looks. I sanded it and everything. It's not, it's obviously not the best one because, like, me and four other kids did it, but still. Grade 9 wood shop. Yeah. So, anyways, um, I'd like to thank you guys for watching once again. Uh, sorry there hasn't been, like, any uploads whatsoever. I'm trying to change that, and I'm trying to get videos out again as, like, soon as possible and stuff. Just because I haven't been able to buy anything, but yeah. So hopefully that'll, uh, hopefully that'll, will, um, all change. And, uh, yeah, see you later.